Hello everybody and welcome back. My name is Pokeboomer7 and last time we trained Randall in this series of Pokemon Blue No Evolutions. I forgot to say what game I'm playing, but you should all know by now. And if you don't, it's okay. We love you. Moving on. Last episode we trained and bought one single potion after selling half of my stock of things I owned so that we could face Brock. And here we go for second attempt against Brock. We almost beat him last time. No evolutions. I am going the hardest path out of the three Pokemon you choose from, and that is Charmander. I think I'm going to die on the other side of this microphone. But it's okay. Death is just a part of life. And I will make my way through death. Maybe. <coughs> Brock's half naked. I never noticed that. Alright. So Randall, you are probably the worst decision to have out first. I did not think about that first. We're going to send Pecker back out. We should have just enough, plus two. If I remember correct, Geodude has normal attacks. Moving on! Sand attack! Should save us. Ta-ta! And I just like completely zoned out and forgot, hey, you know, I'm actually doing this for YouTube. And just stop talking for a second. I also was just like reading everything and playing the game. Like I had a little Game Boy in my hand and was like, oh my god, that's an awesome game. And completely forgot what I was doing. But um, the goal here is mainly just make Geodude to where he can't attack shit. Don't give a damn if he uses defense curl. I just don't want him to attack. And we save 10 of those PP. I think it has 10 PP. See, he can still attack, but at least Flamer can stand up to it. Pecker should be our last resort on Onyx, honestly. I kind of planned this battle out since the last one, just thinking a little bit what would be the easiest way to do this and yes but he's gonna use fucking full heal which I never knew he owned because I don't think I've ever actually burnt or paralyzed or done any status ailment to Geodude or Onyx while playing this because I normally use Bulbasaur which Bulbasaur is the best. I feel as if I've disgraced him by not using him in this battle, but he will understand, for I have small figurines of him throughout my room. Throughout my room, I mean two figurines. Still, he's the best. When it comes to the first-gen starters, there's still other Pokemon that are better than Bulbasaur. I'm, I'm not skipping things, because this is, this is the battle where we win. I, I knew we wouldn't win last time, so I just went ahead and started skipping mid-battle, so... Don't judge. So far, so good. The plan is working. I'm still lower level on all my Pokémon. I'm still lower level than all of Brock's. I have none of his weaknesses. I'm just using status ailments. And, uh, downers? Sounds like I'm giving him drugs, but I'm using downers, so. Yes, I will change out Pokemon, because we're going to save Flamer's life as long as possible. While at the same time, Flamer will more than likely be... Oh, okay. Come on, Randall. All you gotta do is bring his defense down. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Okay. 
and it missed. Good, good, good. Good, good, good. Nothing happened. Okay. Now this is where we do a Pokemon swap. Bring out Flamer. Use Ember again until we run out of PP on it, if it takes that much. And before he dies, Flamer's last move will be to use a potion on um, Randall to bring him back up to full health. So uh, my dog is like whining for no apparent reason. Bring him back, bring Randall back to full health as to let him have the final blow and possibly bring him up to level 10 and be pretty close to par. Okay, he was supposed to get the final blow. So, I'm gonna go ahead and use the potion. We're gonna improvise. I hope this doesn't ruin my plan horribly. We should still have enough. We'll go ahead and have Pecker go next. We'll improvise the plan. Improvising the plan works every time, right? Okay, we burn the rock. Burn the rock. And that should kill me. Okay, now, plan B is sand attack once again. The, those 10 PP I saved should be enough to bring his accuracy down to save the life of Oh, thank you, Bide. You have perfect timing, Brock, to use the dumbest move. Come on. Yes! See? See? See, this is how you... This is like the only way to win a battle where you have no chance. Lower their defense, lower their accuracy, and you win. Because it doesn't matter about lowering their attack, you just need to keep them from attacking. Then you don't take any damage. Let's see, he's not going to do anything. But we can get him down. Sooner or later he's going to have a tackle or something that makes it through. Unless Pecker actually wins. See? He's gonna have one attack that makes it through. It kills Pecker. We bring out Randall and we just beat the shit out of Brock. In one foul swoop, we beat the shit out of Brock with quick attack. See? And Randall's gonna level the fuck up. It don't matter, cause you won't hit me with anything else. You are a dumb anal bead dragon. BAM! You were beaten by a mouse, bitch. Sorry, I'm being vulgar tonight. Look at 324 experience points. He only needed 209. Alright! I feel like I accomplished something today. I beat Brock using first evolution Pokemon on everybody. No elemental kick in the ass helping hands here. I feel like I have made an accomplishment. And I, I did not use a Caterpie who I played for five hours and evolved it into a Butterfree just to have an advantage against Brock. I stayed away from Caterpie because I can't evolve him and it wouldn't have been worth anything. All it have done is bring down his speed. What's the point of that? And I have money to get potions now. Yeah, take this. It's TM34. Contains a technique that can be taught to Pokemans. A TM is good only once. So when you use one to teach a new technique, Hit the Pokemon carefully. Oh. I hate that move. Alright, so we beat Brock. 
soon we'll be going to the next town or route or wherever because I don't remember off the top of my head where we're going next but that little dork kid should be gone he is he's not going to stop me now and here we are the next route so I'm gonna call it quits here guys I'm still amazed that I was able to make it through that. That was um, probably the best part I've had so far, and the game's only begun. So check back here sometime soon, and I will post the next episode of Pokemon Blue No Evolution. Until next time, goodbye. <laughs>